What's up everyone, Mark from Rusty Butcher here again. We're gonna do a little install video on a lowbrow fender, the Tsunami fender for a rubber mount, and then the rubber mount built wall seat. Give this bike a little bit more of a tracker look. But then we're gonna be taking off the fender, cutting the struts, taking off the blinkers, all that stuff, uh, taking off the seat, redoing the ECM, or I guess relocating it so it fits and everything, because this is an 07. On those sevens, they're unfortunately right here, which is in the way. But uh, we're gonna do a few little things and have a cool little video for you guys. First up, I obviously unbolted the seat already, so we're gonna get rid of that. And then uh, I took out all the bolts from the strut, took this off, and now we just need to get this top bolt out, and the fender should be a little loose to where we could start unplugging everything. Since we got all the old stuff off, we're going to mock up the new lowbrow fender, hand tighten the bolts right here and figure out where we want to cut it, and then uh, get to grinding. So what I normally do is it comes around like this. That's like kind of where the fender goes. So I always just round these off. So I cut them right around the bolt and then nice and a little round. Now it's time to clean this sucker up, round it off a little bit more that we got it off. Once I'm done cutting and everything, I always hit it with a little bit of this stuff right here. It's gloss black, it looks just like the powder coat. It dries super quick. Just kind of don't mask off anything like a boss. Good as new. Or about 20 minutes into this, I already got the struts cut, I rounded off, and the fender can bolt on now. Okay, this thing's ready to bolt on. Lowbrow actually supplies you with nuts and bolts for this thing, so we're going to use those. There's a few ways that people do this, and this is how I do it. I unplug the computer and then reroute all this wiring to the other side of the Once this is all pulled over here. So then on those sevens, you can reroute it right here. And then some kind of zip tie or something, ghetto hold it right there. Next up, we got to mock up the seat to drill the hole. Make sure that's all the way forward. And then take this, and mark a hole, and drill it out. So once that hole's drilled, put the seat back on. Make sure you didn't fuck it up. Put the hardware through. Tighten it up. And everything's on. So this is on. Bolted up. Now we just need a dirt tire for our little cheap street tracker build on this sports we picked up for 1500 bucks. 